Determine the coordinates of the vertex and the focus, equation of the directrix and the length of the lattice rectum of the parabola, 4x squared plus y equals to 0. Let us begin. So here we have the equation of the parabola given to us, uh, 4x squared plus y equals to 0. Now we're going to rewrite this equation as 4x squared equals to negative y. We get x squared equals to negative 1 over 4y. The reason why we're going uh, writing in this particular fashion, because this has the similarity with the standard form x squared equals to negative uh, 4by. Now, let's try to graph the parabola x squared equals to negative by. So, we will consider the x-axis and we have the y-axis. Now, a parabola with the equation x squared minus 4by is going to be having its vertex at the origin, that means 0, 0. And the negative sign tells us that it's going to be in the downward direction. So it's a downward facing parabola. So here we have the parabola facing downwards. Now, the y-axis is going to become the axis of the parabola because by definition, the line on which the vertex of a parabola lies becomes the axis of the parabola. So that means on the same axis of the parabola is going to lie the focus. So we have the focus. We're going to consider the coordinates of the focus to be 0, comma, negative p. Negative because it's below the origin. Now, we will consider another point on the same axis, on the uh, axis of the parabola, and name it a, such that if we draw a line uh, passing through point a and parallel to the x-axis or we can say perpendicular to the axis of the parabola then this particular line is going to become the equation of the directrix and we know any line which is parallel to the x-axis it's given by the equation y equals to positive p now we have positive p because it's lying above the x-axis now here a is chosen in a very specific way that's how we know that y will be equals to b the distance of point A from the vertex B is exactly the same as the distance of the vertex, uh, of distance of the focus from the vertex. So that's going to be B. So that means this length is B. Mm, this length is also B as well. That's how we got to know that the equation of the director is Y equals to B. Next, we have to define the lattice rectum. The lattice rectum is defined as the line which passes through the focus of the parabola. It is perpendicular to the axis of the parabola with its endpoints on the, the parabola. Now, that is the uh, lattice rectum, and its length is given by the absolute value of 4 times b. Now, we all have all the information that we need. We can now define the coordinates of the vertex. So, coordinate of the vertex will be at 0, 0. That's by definition. And then we have the coordinates of the focus. So that's 0, comma negative b. So that means we will need to find out the value of b in our case. So here, when we compare x squared minus or one quarter, uh, negative 1 quarters of y with the standard form, then this gives us the value of 4b as equals to 1 over 4, which means the value of b is 1 over 16. That means our focus will be, so that's 0, comma, negative b. That's given by 0, comma, negative 1 over 16. Then we have the equation of the directrix. The equation of the directrix, which is given by y equals to positive b. That means y will be equals to 1 over 16. And then finally, we can obtain the length of the lattice rectum. The length of the lattice rectum, which is given by absolute value of 4b. Replacing the value b with 1 over 16, so we're going to get 1 over 4. Now that's going to be the length of the lattice rectum of the given parabola.